A temporary lane has been created on the southbound lane of the Sir Solomon Ho Choi Highway near Macaulay, Claxton Bay to facilitate roadworks after a landslip in the area worsened. Last week, motorists heading south were caught in hours of traffic as the highway near Macaulay was reduced to one lane. Minister of Works and Transport Rohan Sinanan says sometime in 2014, the land actually started to move and a retaining wall was put down the slope. However, that was not able to stop the land movement. The movement would have been significant. Um, it's a massive land movement taking place in the area. So what we do, we're putting in some temporary work where we could maintain the two lanes and we start the permanent work uh, later on in the week. What we're trying to establish is to secure the highway at this point in time so that we don't have to close it off. And Minister Sinanan says the highway will be reduced to one lane in the night from 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. to allow the rehabilitation works to be conducted. They, you know, they have to, to proceed with caution. We have a lot of signage. It will be a construction zone for some time. Um, and we ask that you bear with us, but for us to complete this, this, this job, we have to you know, create some level of inconvenience, although we will try our best to minimize it and have the work done in the night. The Ministry of Works and Transport has also embarked on a project to expand the North-South Highway to three lanes. Minister Sinanan says when completed, one of the lanes will be designated for high occupancy vehicles. One of the projects we embark on this year is to widen the highway from Shogwanas all the way to San Fernando on a fees basis. So one of the challenges getting into Port of Spain from the southern region is the fact that we actually operate for most part on a two-lane highway. Uh, the, the program that we are on is to actually increase the, the highway to three lanes, both southbound and northbound. 